Well, the Nippon Foundation's uh, challenge of mapping all the oceans by 2030 is phenomenal. Everybody's excited about what we're doing here for um, the design and installation of uh, electric and hybrid systems on boats. And to be able to build and develop crewless vessels where we're still very much a crew upstairs driving the boat, but not having to have them offshore, um, reduces the, the fuel dramatically. Seekit is already contributing to our mission, from data gathered during the uncrewed transatlantic survey through to data that's being provided around the Tonga eruption site. That is a huge game changer to filling gaps in the World Ocean Map. You need to be able to get vessels out there collecting data that aren't polluting well you know, and, and aren't as expensive as the current solutions. And so by introducing vessels of this size that are able to do the jobs of big ships, you're really you know, cracking into something amazing there that's facilitating that to be done by 2030. By quickly developing and launching 15, 20 of these vessels, uh, you know, you're, you're mapping vast amounts of area so much quicker and, and, and cheaper than you would have done before. And because and they can process remotely, they can have a shift system working in New Zealand, Japan, UK, but they can do it on any time zone, which is uh, really exciting.